rounding numbers. Rounding means replacing a number with an approximate value, so it is simpler and easier to use. So instead of telling your new friend that you are 9 years, 4 months, 3 weeks and 2 days old, which is your real, accurate age, you simply say you are 9 years old. Many items round up or down for easier selling and to help customers calculate how much they need to spend. It's so much simpler for everyone. We can round numbers up or round numbers down. Let's have a look at the rules. When you are asked to round numbers, you should also note what you are being asked to round to. It could be the nearest whole number, the nearest 10, the nearest 100 or the nearest 1000. Sometimes, if you are very smart, you could be asked to round up to the nearest million. Rounding to the nearest 10 If the unit of the number is 5 or above, the number needs to be rounded up. If the unit of the number is less than 5, the number needs to be rounded down. 74 rounds down to become 70. 967 rounds up to become 970. Rounding to the nearest 100. Let's look at this number, 7684. We want to round it to the nearest 100, so we look at the tens column. If the tens digit is less than 50, the number is rounded down. If the tens digit is 50 or more, the number is rounded up. The 8 in the tens column is more than 5. It represents 8 tens or 80. So we round it up. So the answer is 7,700. Rounding to the nearest thousand. 1,356. We can look at the hundreds column. The 3 in the hundreds column is less than 5. It represents 300. So we round down. And the answer is 1,000. Rounding is especially good for estimating answers to calculations when checking your work. Before you do a calculation like 198 times by 4, we can round 198 up to 200. 200 times 4 equals 800, so the real answer should be close to this number. The real answer to 198 multiplied by 4 is 792, which is very close to my estimate of 800. Finally, rounding is most useful when it comes to talking big numbers. And we mean really big numbers. It's so nice and easy to state there are 1.4 billion people in China. The real number would look like this. Yup, you would have to say 1,443,945,659. Whew! I need to sit down after saying this. Let's review the rules. We use rounded numbers to understand and simplify numbers. If the number is 5 or higher, go up. When rounding numbers below 5, round down. Check if you are being asked to round to the nearest whole number, 10, 100, 1000 or even 10,000. Use rounded numbers to help you with adding, subtracting and multiplication so you can get a rough estimate. So, there you go. You should now be a rapid rounder and be able to do lots of these questions on your own.